Hi parents, good afternoon. So this week we are going to be talking about reduce, reuse, and recycle. So all of our activities is going to be based on that. Uh, let me show you what we are going to be doing. The parents are, have, some parents have asked me to post these videos every week because it's easier to know what the activity is about. So expect to get a video every uh, Monday, okay? So uh, since we're talking about re this is recycling, so what your child is going to look in every item and you're going to pick which one is a paper, glass, metal, or plastic. Which one of these is made out of that, that it can be uh, recycled. This one here, Recycle, reuse, or compost. So here, uh, they're going to have to pick the items that belong to this group. So let the recycle group, which of these items can be recycled, which of these items can be reused, and which of these items can be composted. Okay, uh, since it's uh, Earth Month, that's why we are going to be talking about this this month. And I think it's a great time for you to be talking your, to your child about the import importance of it. Here, for the older children, I have included, um, no, this one I think I have included for everybody, I'm sorry. But this one, they have to find the uppercase E and the lowercase E, they have to circle every that they find. And what they can do after they're done, they can count to see how many of each they have. This one here, they're going to look for the symbols, count them, and circle them. This one is what I put, I put for the older children. They are going to be tracing the letters. Earth, recycle, warm. So those are the, begin, the beginning letters. For the younger ones, uh, I, just I just included um, some tracing materials. Okay, so, and this one here, we are going to be doing a picture of our earth. So, and this is a cutting activity also because some of the kids need help with cutting. So your child is going to cut along the line, cut little circles of blue, which is going to be representing the water. The green is going to be pre uh, representing the earth, okay? Uh, let me know if you need scissors. I have some training scissors here also. One of the parents have asked me for it, and I have extra ones here if you need. So please let me know if you need scissors, if you need glue for the activities, okay? Um, your activities are going to be going in a plastic in this bag this week, and we are also going to be using this for FaceTime. We are going to be using the bag and the newspaper for FaceTime. We are going to be talking how we can use other materials to do our work. So um, if you want, you can trace shapes or you can trace uh, whatever you want. You can trace a flower, picture, whatever you wanna do. Help your child cut it out. This is another cutting activity also. I decided to make, cut out some circles and I made a, um, a flower out of it. Okay, so this is what we are going to be doing for FaceTime. So this bag in here, what I, the only thing I did, I cut this piece out, and that's what I, uh, we are going to be using. Okay, so if you can help your child with that, that would be great. Uh, there's another activity too that I also included. It's going to be coming in this little bag over here. Um, so you decide, they're both um, can do, you know, pick which one you wanna do at FaceTime. Uh, this one here, is a disposable bag. Actually, um, yeah, this is a, I was thinking either to do it at FaceTime or Zoom, but I have other ideas for Zoom. So this one here, it's a reusable bag and um, one less plastic bag for the environment. I included some paint. I included a newspaper because if you decide not to do the activity with me, what you're going to do when you open you're going to put the newspaper inside the bag so when your child paint, it's not going to bleed through, okay? So this is what the newspaper is for. Be careful with this paint because it's not washable. 
So be aware that if your child get it on his or her clothes, it's going to stain. Okay, uh, I'm going to be sending books, videos of books uh, related to reuse, recycle, composting. So be on the lookout for that. Okay, let me know if you have any question, questions and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.